The Removalist covers a lot of different themes that uh, were relevant in 1971 when the play was written and, uh, and are still relevant today. Uh, things like domestic violence or violence against women, um, police brutality and, and people's relationships with authority figures. Uh, and uh, just the, uh, the gender divide and how women were treated and respected compared to what they are now. And one of the really intriguing things for me is um, the, the idea of how far have we come. We chose to set the play in its original setting in 1971. Situations like the police violence and uh, corruption and uh, the power and authority figures, um, that kind of violence can still occur at any time in any place. And uh, Michelle Mile, the director, uh, was quite keen to explore um, the difference between uh, authority and power. And and is there a difference between who has the power in each scene and who has the authority? Because while you might have a badge that says you're a policeman, when you're up against a removalist who's been removing furniture for years, you don't actually have the power because you can't argue against someone that knows everything about everything that they're doing. So there is a big difference between power and authority and, it, and it's relevant to all the relationships in the play. Uh, younger audiences just should see this production because it is, even though it was written 40 years ago, it is quite challenging to watch and it's important to see sort of confrontational things that might challenge the attitudes of, um, you know, how people are treated, how uh, violence can be treated, how things are dealt with. Um, so it's important to see that sort of thing just to start opening up, you know, ideas and dialogue about different situations. I think this is an important production for younger audiences to see because it is uh, one of the most enduring scripts, Australian scripts ever written, one of the most enduring Australian plays. It's, it's been relevant for 40 years and it's stood the test of time. Uh, and it's a great snapshot of people's attitudes and the way that life was in the, in the early 1970s. And it was written at a time when David Williamson was only his, his second play and, and it's, it sort of represents this brave new world of Australian playwriting where they could take a few more risks and a few more um, chances and, and, and swear a bit more and have a bit more violence and that sort of thing. So it actually represents a sort of a, a big a time of change and, and real guts from Australian playwrights that has shaped the way that plays have been written in this country for the last 40 years. Mm -hmm.